Hey everyone, my name is Grape Applesauce, and welcome back to another episode of the Cube SMP. And we are here at spawn. We're gonna shoot this zombie off of there. You're not allowed on there. What are you doing? Get out of there. <laughs> We're on the cube, and uh, if you guys are enjoying this episode, be sure to leave a like. Really does help out. And we're going to check out Rusher's Obsidian Shop. I know I showed a little sneak peek of it uh, in the last episode. But I want to go see what it's actually looking like now. Did they retexture fire? It looks like it looks like everything got a retexture. Like all the like enchants are darker. At least on the hot bar it looks like. But uh, yeah, this is the Obsidian Shop. Let's see what he's selling this for. So that's 10 for one gold block with a 25% discount. I really don't know how many that is. Nine, so take nine gold blocks, or nine gold rather, nine gold ingots, times 0.25. That'd be two, 2.25 2 gold. So we'll just round that up, I guess. We'll say three gold ingots per um, 10 obsidian. That's a pretty dang good deal if my math is right, which it probably isn't knowing my math, but. I think that's a good deal if I need to get obsidian to like prank somebody or something that's gonna be helpful we need to clear these zombies they keep trying to kill Carlton he's just working hard at his 24 7 job you don't need to kill him I kind of want your chain armor though so give me that of course I didn't get it all right we're gonna check out Grazer's shop as well he told me to check it out in my episode look at this floating steak it's cool new little snapshot edition there I don't think it was uh on purpose I'm pretty sure that's a glitch but get over it anyway hello creep all right yeah we got like floating everything it's quite weird how that works but I love the tablets though I did tweet out a picture of me and Grazer uh, gray gray because of our heads we're next to the the icon it looks pretty cool so I'm pretty happy with that I really, really like that addition it's kind of very small but I like it anyway all right let's see Grazer's goodies before I go in here I'm gonna stack up on some uh, Actually, it's not by diamonds anymore, so I'm going to stack up on some of this there. Some of that gold. All right, let's see what we got here. Silk Touch, three gold blocks per book. That's a pretty good deal. I might have to get, buy one of those because I quite need a uh, another Silk Touch pick. Um, smite 2 for two gold blocks. Are you serious? For Smite 2. Come on, Grazer, you're out of your mind. Or wait, did this say eight? Okay, eight gold blocks. It was like three. That's a ripoff. I mean, for you, not me. Slime blocks, eight gold ingots per ten. Glowstone. Is this all he's selling? Is this guy serious? Oh, there we go. Stone brick, diorite, soul sand. Oh, he's selling them for one gold ingot per stack. He's going to run mine out of business. That's all right. Mine's just for the uh, withers anyway. Mossy stone. Does he have anything else? I require more than that. Come on, Graze. I needed a. Uh, I'm not. I guess I might buy a Silk Touch. I don't know if I really need these. We need to check Parker's shop before I make my final decision on that purchase. I'm gonna check his shop out and make sure that's a good deal, the best deal I can get. And Parker's shop is right over here. Let's go past my shop, which I do need to restock. Try and do that soon. All right, let's see how much you sell on Silk Touch for in here. New books ready underwater. Oh yeah, the new snapshot. You can um, climb like underwater. One of these enchants is like the uh, Depth Strider, which means you can walk like full speed underwater. I'm really liking that enchant. I think that's pretty cool. Oh, that's a pretty good for 12. So where's Silk Touch? Silk Touch, Silk Touch gonna be in here so that's for 10 grazer was selling it for eight so ooh, silk touch i'm breaking three though i'm gonna have to do that one i believe i just bought a silk touch no that was efficiency from parker that i bought so yeah i'm gonna get that that's the best deal in here silk touch i'm breaking three that's gonna be 10 spend i'll gladly spend these 10 on you here because i'm gonna need another silk touch one soon so there's 10 gold blocks and we're gonna go find <laughs> his reverse taxes there all right yep we got that so we're gonna be able to get a fully good done up pick right there so I'm happy with that and believe that's about it I need to see if there was anything else I needed to look at around spawn I did kind of want to try the lottery 
But I'm not really feeling it today. I'm not I'm not feeling this week is going to be mine, so I'm just not going to do that. We're going to just run over here quickly. I don't I don't think there's anything else. Did you already check out the museum? Yeah, I think that's about it. So, I'm going to go ahead and get to today's clips. I'm going to be working on my eco. I'm going to be trying to make some more gold blocks. I have a deal I'm going to work out with Pat. And other than that, I'm just going to go ahead and get to it. Hope you enjoy it. All right, guys, and we are back here at spawn with grape applesauce. How's Yo, it going? Pat clone, I'm doing good. I'm ready for some publicity stunts going on. Wait, I got a question for you, real quick. Do you like my that? floating steak? I love your floating steak. Do you like my floating ender pearls? <laughs> I got some of those too. Carrots? They're new. <laughs> the new <laughs> items are cool. Oh, I got man. my floating enchanted potion here too. What else do I have? Do these float? <laughs> no, they. Go through the hand. <laughs> That's so weird. Okay, <laughs> anyway, sorry. <laughs> All right, so basically, there's been a significantly higher demand for the items that I'm selling at my shop. So basically, I'm going to hire my friend Grape here to go ahead and fill up my shop for me. Uh, so did we agree on a price, Mr. Grape Applesauce? No, I don't believe so yet, but I, I, I'm I, going to stock your shop, all right? I'm going to get a haste two beacon up there. There'll be sand, like, mm. out the brim. You won't even be able to count it all. <laughs> Wow, that is a lot. Okay, Haste so. two for the win. Let's let's get a price going here. Do you have any gold blocks on you, or do we need to go to the bank? Um, I don't, but we can go and convert some. All right, let's so, do it. I haven't really done go. this yet, so that should be good for me to see how right, it works. So uh, let me go ahead and go to the ATM over here and grab some diamonds out of here. Uh, how many diamonds are you looking at, or gold blocks? Uh, I for how much do you want? Like a full double chest, or what? Um. Well, my the chests I have are single chests in the shop, so I have um, I guess just a double chest of sand. Okay. Would be good. That'll work. Do you want me yeah. to like split into sandstone or anything, or just sand? Um. Yeah. Well, let's do sandstone too, because I think H needs that. So we could do. Uh, let's do a double chest of sand, and then uh, maybe a half chest of sandstone. So a single chest of sandstone. Yeah. All right. Yep. That sounds good to me. Um. That's probably going to rip me through this entire diamond shovel here, so... Um, let's see, I'm trying to think what would be a good price we can negotiate on here. Um, would he say like 15 gold blocks? Is that too much? Um, oh, you're lagging, Pat. <laughs> Pat's lagging. It's uh, lagging. Okay, now I can do you. There we go. There we go. <laughs> um, <laughs> uh, I think, you know what? I think that's fair. I think get that's fair. I'm doing chest. all the mining, the double chest, yeah, and, the sand, the and the sandstone. Well. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, that's fair. Okay, so let's go ahead and go over to the bank, and we'll go ahead and convert these diamonds to gold blocks. All right. Uh, so <laughs> Pat, you're a robot again. Oh, I'm a robot. Oh, there you go. You're good. All right, there we go. I don't know what's up with that. Yeah, that's weird. Uh, yeah, but you said you've not done this before, correct? Nope, so I'm going to see how this works. As I know okay. it said something like only for purchases, and this is a purchase. <laughs> yeah, this is a purchase. I did this once because I was buying uh, wood from Russia's shop. Mm -hmm. but anyway, so basically you come to the bank here, all the way to the end. You've got a payments chest and a uh, chest full of gold blocks. So we'll go yeah. ahead and dump 15 diamonds in there. Go and count these out. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three. All right, so we have 15, 15. gold blocks here. And these are for you, sir. Oh, thank you. Yep. All right, I'm going to run off. Thanks. All right, no problem. And uh, <laughs> I'm just look kidding. forward to seeing my shop filled. <laughs> <laughs> or else I'll be at your doorstep. Yeah. I don't want Pat at my doorstep. Look at him. He's all covered in what is this dust? Have you not cleaned up in a while or yeah, what? Yeah, I uh, accidentally slipped into a 50s television, <laughs> television show earlier today. So. Uh, it looks like it. Hasn't cool. worn off quite yet. 15 but, um, gold blocks. That's what I'm talking about. Yep. All right, so, so is that good? You want me to get good. to work? Am I gonna use your your area, or yep. do you need me to go find my own? My area, my desert. I've got that haste beacon there um, for you to go ahead and mine out. I put it right, right next to the hill because I figured that would actually be a pretty good place to use that at. So yep. yeah, we're, we're gonna get haste two up in this though. I need I need to make maximum gold here, so I'm gonna get this done as fast as possible. Yep, definitely. <laughs> Ever since the new currency came out, it's like I need to get all this gold. Like heck, <laughs> diamonds. Who needs that anymore? <laughs> All right, just for tools and things like that. Yep. It's all about gold now. Definitely. All right. All right. Well, sounds good, Pat. Thank you for your business. I will get you that as soon as possible. All right. Thank you very much. Bye-bye. 
So I actually did some scavenging before this, uh, before I actually went and did some work at Pat's house. And I realized how much sand I already have. So that's like a quarter maybe of the work already cut out. I'm just going to go ahead and place this um, in his shop. He didn't really say like to put it outside or anything. So I'm just going to put it in here. We'll do all the sand, see how much that is. And then the sandstone in here. Yeah, this is going to be a lot of work. I don't know if 15 gold blocks is going to be worth it, but... I'm gonna do it. I'll keep my word because it should go by pretty quickly. I'm assuming um, We'll just make all this into sandstone. Why not? See how much sandstone we can get out of this There's a stack. Oh, yeah, we're gonna need to make all this into sandstone Jeez Because this is what That's not gonna be enough there So that's what <laughs> oh yeah, we're gonna need a lot of work, so <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and head over to Pat's house, or actually I'm gonna head to my house first, and we're gonna get this haste 2 beacon, we're gonna move it over to Pat's. So we're here at the Grapey residence, we are going to go ahead and take down this beacon we needed for Pat's build, I'm sorry, or not his build, but we just need it to work for Pat, I'll put it back later. I do need those gold blocks, because those are now worth something, and I'm not gonna put them on my beacon. I'm just going to leave those uh, beacons there because Pat has his own. And we should only need one. Uh, we should only need one, the haste two at his place. So I'm just going to leave these ones here. I'm just going to tear this down and use all this iron. I can't believe how much iron this thing takes to get. And I really don't need iron anymore either. I mean, there's some over there. I'm not even going to grab it. I'll just buy from Grazer Shop. But yeah, this episode, I really just want to focus on, you know, getting my economy up because I don't have very many gold blocks compared to diamonds, and I really want to change that. I might see if I can get a few more gold blocks out of pack. I don't really know how long this is going to take, but I know it may take a little bit, and uh, it's going to cost some diamonds to repair my shovel as well. So we'll see if I can get a few more. If it doesn't take very long, then I, just, I won't ask for any more, but... <laughs> it does seem like a lot more the sandstone is what made it really tough to uh, Get all this or made it sound tough because I haven't even filled sandstone I grabbed all the sand that I already had to I had some at my house that I just thought I'd throw in the deal All right, let's finish grabbing these but yeah, this might take a little bit We'll see how it goes. So I'm gonna bring in anvil I'll bring diamonds. I got levels already. So this shouldn't be too tough. I'm not imagining See how it goes, but it did help me out that I could use his place because he already has kind of a setup over there. And we're almost done tearing this down. I might have to restock my shops later too. I might do a little bit of that. Because restocking is definitely going to help. You get some gold blocks because my quartz and, and wither skulls are all sold out. I mean, everything I sell seems to get sold out so quickly. It's like you don't even get a chance to restock it before it's just gone. Oh, we're almost done here. How much iron is this? Wow, this is well over three stacks of iron blocks. Wow. This is over three stacks of iron blocks for this one beacon. Massive beacon. So I really shouldn't need all this to get this beacon here. I don't think I'll need that. That was just for four. Alright, I'm gonna go to Pat's place and I will be right back. With my trusty shovel at hand, I am at Mr. Clone's house here. I set up a beacon over here. It's only got haste on it right now, but we are going to change that to haste 2. Let's not use a diamond because that would not be a good idea. And we're going to go ahead and place an iron in there. Haste 2. And that should change to haste 2. Okay, now we have everything we need. I believe, yeah, I can only pick one since there's only one beacon. And I believe we should be able to go ham. Oh my goodness, yes. Yes. I love this already. I don't know. This should be pretty easy, actually, to fill that entire double chest over there. Oh, yeah. This is fun. This is fun. Let's not explode my shovel, though. I got to keep uh, weariness about this shovel. I don't want it to break while I'm mid-shoveling. Mid well, this is um pretty relaxing, to say the least. Let's go ahead around and collect. See how much I got just by doing that. Should be, like, enough to make some sort of difference. Because these looks like big stacks right here. Alright, that was probably, what, like, 30 seconds of just spam clicking and holding down my left click button? You guys know I like my left click button. <laughs> left click. Wow, we got all those stacks just from that. Hmm. That was easy. Alright, let's keep going at it then. Alright. Alright. 
Oh yeah, something I did want to talk about. Um, it has been a couple weeks since I did hit 100k. And I still want to let you guys know I'm still trying to plan out a special. Um, I have it all planned out and in my head. I just haven't got enough time to do it. It's really hard as you guys know. I do work a schedule that is full time. And I do work nights mostly. So I get home pretty late. Most if not all of my videos are recorded except on my days off. I record at like 2 a.m. plus. So you have to kind of work with me there and understand I can't always, you know, have the energy to record a special. Uh, one of these weekends, I am going to get on it, though. I'm not forgetting. I still plan on doing it because I still want to do it. And, uh, yeah, I'll be doing that. Have it all planned out in my head, and it's going to be awesome. I think you guys will enjoy it. It's something I've never really done before. So, uh, yeah, hope you will all like that. It will be coming pretty soon. So if you want to follow me on Twitter, I definitely suggest doing that because it, it might have to do with Twitter. So that's always in the description of all, of all my videos. Go ahead and follow me at Grape Apple's House. And uh, yeah, I will be posting probably something to do with it pretty soon there. So just make sure you stay tuned on there. Uh, yeah, let's see how much sand we got now. That's almost a full inventory already. That was like a minute of talking, not even. I like me some haste too. I think haste too is like the best thing that ever happened in this game for like mining and shoveling sand, cutting down trees. Like what is what what like haste two is good for everything. What isn't it good for? I mean, even killing grazer. I could swing my sword way faster if I want to kill grazer that way. <laughs> Just kidding. We don't kill grazer like that, do we? Nobody kills grazer. He doesn't deserve it. He. I mean, he doesn't go around trying to kill us. Why would we do that to him? All right, that should be enough sand for our sandstone. Hopefully, probably not. I don't remember how many we had at the shop, so I'm just gonna fill whatever is over here. All right, that's a couple stacks there. Sand. Okay. That was only a couple stacks of sand, so I'm kind of crying right now. <laughs> QQ cry. I'm not going to do all this on camera, by the way. I just want to make sure I have a decent amount here while I'm recording. See how much realistically this can get me in a certain amount of time. So that's sandstone there. All right, yeah, this is going to be tough. I'm going to do a lot more mining, and I will be back in a little bit. Well, after all this carnage, my work here is finally done. If I go ahead and look in this chest, full double chest of sand, full double chest of sandstone. It made it a lot easier because there's a lot of sandstone around here. I pretty much took out this entire area, and I'm, I'm pretty satisfied with, with all the work I've done. I don't know about 15 gold blocks. As I was doing this, I was thinking like, hey... How much profit is Pat going to make off of all this stuff? So what I thought I'd do is i uh, get all this together and then I'd have a meeting with him and be like, Hey, you're going to make this much off of it and I mind it all plus the labor. You're going to have to pay me this and I think, I think that'll be good. And I'll make it so he still makes a profit because that is the business. But then again, I am doing the labor. So we'll see how it goes. Actually, I might, uh, it might be a better deal for me if I try to get him to pay for labor too because... Um, he'd still be making a profit, just not as much, but he didn't have to do anything. I did all the work for him. So I'm going to go ahead and transport all this stuff, take the beacon down, and I will meet you at his shop. So we're back at the Pat stand here, the Pat Sand stand, and we have everything he needs right here. And I was actually checking the prices. He doesn't sell these for very much. So I think I did get a really good deal here. Um, the best thing is glass there. So if I was getting him glass, I would expect uh, probably more, but... As far as the sand and sandstone, I think I caught a pretty dang good deal considering he sells this for eight uh, gold ingots per stack. And this is two, so I got a great deal here. I was like going to be like, hey, man, I need some more. But I was like, no, he's not even selling it for that much. So we're going to write our sign here. Pat, here is your sand and sandstone. Ah, won't fit on the line. Sandstone. Enjoy. All right. He's going to know that was me. I don't have another sign. He's going to know that's me anyway. So we'll all be good with that. And um, with that, I don't believe there's anything else I'd like to do. So if you all enjoyed this episode of the Cube SMP, be sure to leave a like. It really does help. And I now have, let's check for my uh, gold. Now we got to check my gold. We got to check how much profit I made before I leave. All right. Let's check the profits. 
All right, we're up to 50 gold blocks now, which is not bad. I'm probably going to go mine off camera and go refill my shop and uh, get some more gold blocks. So once again, if you did enjoy, be sure to leave a like. Really does help out. And that, I will see you all in the next episode of The Cube. Thank you all for watching. Goodbye.